You can't be that stupid. That's what I think sometimes when I'm speaking to clients, but those clients I think are stupid are actually some of the smartest clients you're ever gonna work with. The thing is here, what they do, and if you didn't know this, clients act dumb. And they act so dumb that it beats you into submission, where in the end, you just get so frustrated, you say, take it from me, I don't care, take it at whatever price. That is their objective, to beat you into submission so much that you get so frustrated you end up giving it away. So if you didn't know this, hopefully now you've learned that there are clients out there that act so dumb that in the end, you just want rid of them. If you can keep your cool with this, you're gonna to get to the end. But I need you to remember as well, do you really wanna be working with these people? If you're gonna bring that client on board and that's something you're gonna to have to care for and look after, do you even want them as a client? And if you have to hand that over to an account manager who's your colleague, are they really gonna be thanking you for it? And would you want them doing that to you? So think about this, yes, we need deals at the moment, but in the long term, is that somebody you really want to be working with and for? I don't think so. There's only so many hours that we're gonna be working here and you wanna be working with the right sort of people. Not those frustrating idiots that act dumb, beat you into submission and make you angry for the day. Now I'd love to hear your thoughts on this. I'm trying to spread as much value as possible. If you feel a colleague can benefit from it, tag them in this. If you feel that anyone else can, please like and share. Let's spread it around the community. But I'd love to hear your thoughts as I said. But that's it for today. Thanks a lot and I'll see you tomorrow.